This is my first video about Korean classics. Almost every Korean classics are written in classical Chinese, but they are written by Korean writers and read by Korean readers. My major is both Korean study and sinology, and I'm glad to use my knowledge for this. Just like Japanese kanbun, Korean classics should be read and understood in Korean. If you don't speak Korean, it's okay. All you need to know is how to read Korean alphabets. You can learn it in my channel, or maybe you've already learned. If you don't have time to learn it, please use the subtitle. Before we begin, let me explain something about Samgugyusa. Samgugyusa is written by Ilion from Goryeo. Goryeo was a medieval country located in Korean Peninsula. Samguk indicates Goguryeo, Baekje, Sila, the three kingdoms existed before Goryeo. Yusa means incidents of the past ages. It is the oldest record about Old Joseon. According to this, Old Joseon is founded in 2333 BCE, but there is a lack of evidence, so it's doubtful. We can read this text as a view of history taken by Goryeo people. 위서 운 내왕 이천재 유 단군 왕검 입도 아사달 개국 호 조선 여고 동시 고기 운 석유 환인 석자 환웅 사의 천하 탐구 인세 부지 자의 하시 삼위 태백 가이 홍익 인간 내수 천부인 삼계 견왕 리지 웅 솔도 삼천 강어 태백산 정 신단 수하 위지 신시 시위 환웅 천왕야 장 풍백 우사 운사 이 주곡 주명 주병 주형 주선악 범주 인간 삼백육십 여사 제세 리화 시유 이룽 일호 동혈이 거 상기우 신웅 원화 위인 시 신유 영의 일주 산 이십 매왈 이배 식지 불견 일광 백일 변득 인형 웅호 득이 식지 기 삼칠일 웅득 녀신 호 불능 기이 부득 인신 웅 여자 무여 위혼 고 매어 단수하 주원 유잉 웅내 가화이 혼지 잉 생자 호왈 단군왕검 이 당고직위 50년 경인 도평양성 시칭조선 우 이도어 백악산 아사달 우명 궁홀산 우 금미달 어국 1500년 주호왕 직위 기묘 봉기자어 조선 단군 내 이어 장당경 후환 은어 아사달 위산신 수 1908세 당 배구전 운 고려 본 고죽국 주 이봉 기자 위 조선 한 분치 삼군 위 현도 낭낭 대방 통전 역 동차설 In the Book of Wei, thus is said, two thousand years ago, there was Dan Gun Wanggum. He chose Asadao as the capital and founded a nation. It was named Joseon. This was the same period as Emperor Yao. In the records of old, thus is said, in ancient times, there was Huanin. His illegitimate son, Huanung, pondered all that was under heaven, and he yearned the human realm. The father came to know of his son's thoughts and gazed upon Sami Tebek, which he found suitable to broadly benefit the human world. So he gave Huanung the three heavenly treasures and sent him to rule them. Huanung, with three thousand attendants, descended upon Tebek Mountain and underneath the holy tree, calling that place a city of the gods. He is called Huanung, the heavenly king. He led the count of the wind, the minister of the rain, and the minister of the clouds, to control harvest, to control life, to control disease, to control punishments, to control good and evil, and to control over 360 other matters of humanity, and brought order while residing in the human realm. In those days, there was a bear and a tiger that lived in the same cave, 
who would always pray to the god Huanun so that they could become human. At that moment, the god gave them each a bunch of sacred mugwort and twenty pieces of garlic, and said, "If you eat this and do not see the sunlight for a hundred days, then you will gain human shape." The bear and tiger took and ate them and retired into the cave. In three seven days, the bear gained a woman's body. The tiger, however, was unable and did not gain a human body. The bear woman had no one to wed. As such, she would always pray under the holy tree so that she may conceive. Huanong hence disguised himself and wed her. She conceived and birthed a child. The child's name was Dan Gunangum, and in the fiftieth year of Tang Yao, which was the year of Gong In, he chose Pyongyang Castle as the capital and called it Joseon for the first time. Later, he moved the capital to Asadong of Bagak Mountain, also called Gunho Mountain or Gumbidao. He ruled the nation for one thousand and five hundred years. The King Wu of Zhou ascended to the throne on the year of Ji Mao. And invested Jizi with the nation of Joseon. Dan Gun hence moved to Zhang Dangyong. Later, he returned in hiding to Asadol and became a mountain god. He had lived one thousand and nine hundred and eight years. In the biography per page of Tang Dynasty, thus it said, Goryeo was originally from Gojuk. The Zhou Dynasty invested Jizi with the land of Joseon. The Han Dynasty divided and ruled them as three commanderies: Hyundo, Nagrang, and Debang. Tongdian also has the same story. Wei, it's Wei in Mandarin Chinese pronunciation, name of a country. Cao, book, the Book of Wei. This is a history book of Wei. Unfortunately, this record is not found today. Wun, to say, in the Book of Wei, it is said, ne, then or hence, Wang, to go, go back to the past, Yi Chon, two thousand, Che, year, go further back two thousand years ago, Yu, to have or there be, there was Dan Gunangam, Dan means altar. Kun, ruler or lord, Wang, king, Kom, to be frugal. So we don't know what Dan Gunangam exactly means, but we can guess that it's a ruler or king position. Li, to establish or to found. Tu, the capital city. Asadao is a place name. We don't know the exact location, but it was the capital anyway. Dan Gun chose Asadol as the capital. K to open to start. Ku country. He founded a nation. Hu name. The name was Joseon. It's not a Joseon dynasty, which is very familiar to us. According to this record. It is way much older, so we can call it Old Joseon, not just Joseon. Yao with Ku indicates the Emperor Yao. Why the Emperor Yao or Yo in Korean is written in the Emperor Gao or Emperor Go? The character Yao is replaced by Gao. It's because of the naming taboo. Bi Hui. Or Pihui in Korean, Yu was the name of Zhang Zhong, the third emperor of Goryeo. Now we can see both sides of Korean culture. On the one hand, there is big influence from Chinese culture. On the other hand, they maintained its independence. Let's see it. Yu, the name of the third emperor of Goryeo, was named after Yao, the Chinese saint. However, from that moment, it became the name of Goryeo Emperor, not that of Chinese saint. So Goryeo people changed the name of Chinese saint instead. They changed Yao to Gao. So it is recognized that 
the status of Korea was independent. Some people might think that Korean culture is the same as the Chinese, but it is misunderstanding. 同時,同時, at the same time, with the Emperor Yao. In the Book of Wei, thus is said, 2,000 years ago, there was Dan Gunwangum. He chose Asadao as the capital and founded a nation. It was named Joseon. This was the same period as Emperor Yao. Ko, old, ki, record. In the old record, it is said, Sok, ancient. In ancient times, you, there was. Huan means Chinese soul buried tree. This character is probably miswriting of in. There are a lot of variation in Chinese character. So many. Cha means child or son. Soja indicates every son born after the first son. Wung means male or masculine. Huanun was the son of Huanin. Sak frequently. When it is pronounced like su, it means number. In this case, sak means frequently. Ui, wish or desire. Chona, tianxia, the world. It is under the heaven, literally. Huanong frequently desired the things under the heaven. We can know that Huanin and Huanong was from over the heaven. Tam, to be fond of. Gu, to seek. In means human and se is the world, human realm. He was fond of human realm. Pu, the father. Qi, to know. Cha, his son. Ui, wish. Huanin, the father, knew his son's wish. Ha, under. Xi, to see. Sami, tebek. Sami was another name of mountain Asado. Asada was the capital of old Joseon. Tebek also seems to be a name of mountain. In the records of old, thus is said, in ancient times, there was Huanin. His illegitimate son, Huanung, pondered all that was under heaven, and he yearned the human realm. The father came to know of his son's thoughts and gazed upon Sami Tebek. Kai, Kei. Be able to, hong broad or wide, ik to benefit, ingan human world, ingan means mankind in modern Korean, but it means human world in classics. He was able to broadly benefit the human world. Ne hence, su to give, chunbu in, bu symbol, in. Means stamp or seal, heaven symbol seals. We don't know what they are, but it seems important. Sam three, k piece or unit. He gave Huanong the three heavenly treasures. Kion to send, Wang to go, Li to rule. He sent Huanong to rule them. Ji zhi is a pronoun. Wung, sir, to lead, to follower. Huanong led three thousand followers. Kang, to descend. Oh, Yu has a lot of meanings. It can correspond to English prepositions like to, at, in, on, from, toward, etc. Tebek San, San means mountain, so it's Tebek Mountain. Now there is Taiwan Mountain in Korea, but this one is not that one. Chong summit, the top of mountain. Xin God, Su tree, altar tree of God. Huanong descended upon Taiwan Mountain underneath the holy tree. We to call, Ji that place. Xi means market or city. Calling it the city of the gods, which he found suitable to broadly benefit the human world, so he gave Huanong the three heavenly treasures and sent him to rule them. Huanong, with three thousand attendants, descended upon Tebek Mountain and underneath the holy tree, 
calling that place a city of the gods. Xi means this or these. This man is called Huanong, the heavenly king. Ya, ye is a final particle. Chang to lead. Pung, wind and back count. Pung back the count of the wind. Wu, rain and Sa teacher. Wu Sa the minister of the rain. Wun cloud. Wun Sa. The minister of the clouds, wind, rain, and clouds are important to farming, right? Yi and Chu to administer or to control. Kok harvest to control harvest. Miang life to control life. Piang disease to control disease. Hyang punishment to control punishments. Sun, good, and ak, evil, to control good and evil. Pom, every, ingan, human world. Sambek yukship, three hundred and sixty. Yo, over or more than. Sa, things, matters. He controlled over three hundred and sixty matter of human world. He is called Huanong, the Heavenly King. He led the count of the wind, the minister of the rain, and the minister of the clouds to control harvest, life, disease, punishments, good and evil, and over three hundred and sixty other matters of humanity. Che, zai, to be in. Se, world, in this world. Ri, he ruled. Hua. To become or to civilize, Jiao Hua, Xi, time, at that time, Yu, there were, Wong, bear, Hu, tiger, there was a bear and a tiger, Tong, the same, Hu, cave, Yi, and, Ko, to live. They lived in the same cave. Sang always, Qi to pray. Wu is almost the same as O Yu. They always prayed to the god Huanong. One to want, We has a lot of meanings. To do, to make, to consider, or to become. They wanted to become human. And brought order while residing in the human realm. In those days, there was a bear and a tiger that lived in the same cave, who would always pray to the god Huanong so that they could become human. Xi at that time, Xin God, Yu to live, Liang sacred, E Mogwart, Chu bunch. At that moment, the god lived a bunch of sacred mogwort, san, garlic, me, peace, and twenty pieces of garlic. Why to say? Yi, you, pe, group, shi, to eat. You eat this. Pu, pu, not. Kion, to see. Yi, sun or day, Kuang, light, do not see the sunlight. Pegi, for one hundred days, you eat this and do not see the sunlight for one hundred days. Pion, then, it's something like the, jik in Korean. T, to gain. In hyong, hyong shape. If you eat this and do not see the sunlight for a hundred days, then you will gain human shape," said Huanong. Wong, Hu, the bear and the tiger, they've got it and ate. At that moment, the god gave them each a bunch of sacred mogwort and twenty pieces of garlic, and said, "If you eat this and do not see the sunlight for a hundred days, then you will gain human shape." The bear and tiger took and ate them. Q 
key to avoid or to be careful. They were being careful. 삼칠일, three seven days. Some people say that 삼칠일 means thirty seven days, but almost every people consider it as twenty one days. Three times seven is twenty one. Simple math. 녀, woman. 신, body. The bear gained woman's body. 능, to be able to. 불능, 不能, not able to. The tiger wasn't able to be careful and couldn't get human body. 웅녀, the bear woman. 자, a 자 means one who a, the person who's called the bear woman. 무, to not have or there be not. She had no one to get married to. 고, therefore. 매, every, each, every time. Under the altar tree. 주, to pray. 잉, conceive, to be pregnant. Therefore, she always prayed under the holy tree so that she may conceive. And retired into the cave. In three seven days, the bear gained the woman's body. The tiger, however, was unable and did not gain a human body. The bear woman had no one to wed. As such, she would always pray under the holy tree so that she may conceive. Huanong, hence, ka, to borrow or to fake or to disguise. He disguised and married her. She got pregnant and gave birth to a child. The name was Dangunangam. Tangu is the same as Tang Yao, the Emperor Yao. You remember the naming taboo, right? To, to come near or to ascend. We, position, throne. The Emperor Yao ascended the throne. Wu Xib Nian. And fifty years later, so in the fiftieth year of Emperor Yao, Kyongin, Gongin is from sexagenary cycle, which is traditional year counting of East Asia. To choose the capital, Pyongyang Song. Song means castle. Yes, this Pyongyang is the place we all know. He chose Pyongyang Castle as the capital. She first, Qing to call, calling it Joseon for the first time. Huanong hence disguised himself and wed her. She conceived and birthed a child. The child's name was Dan Gunangum, and in the fiftieth year of Tang Yao, which was the year of Gongin, he chose Pyongyang Castle as the capital and called it Joseon for the first time. Wu, again or also, Yi to move. Again, he moved the capital to Pegaksan, Asadar. Myung, name. Another name was Kunghulsan, Gongho Mountain. Also, Kumitar. O, to rule, Kup, country. He ruled the country for. One thousand and five hundred years later, he moved the capital to Asadol of Bagak Mountain, also called Gungho Mountain or Gumidal. He ruled the nation for one thousand and five hundred years. Chu, Zhou Dynasty, Hu indicates the King Wu of Zhou. This is also the naming taboo. Hejong was the second emperor of Korea, and his name was Mu. He was named after the King Wu. The King Wu ascended the throne in the year of Kimio, Ji Mao. You remember the sexagenary cycle, right? Pong to invest a person with a fifth. Kija, Jizi. The king invested Jizi with Joseon. Dan Gun hands moved to Zhang Dan Gyeong. Hu after Huan to return. 
Lun to hide. Later, he returned and hid to Asado and became a mountain god. Su age. His age was one thousand and nine hundred and eight years old. The King Wu of Zhou ascended to the throne on the year of Ji Mao and invested Jizi with the nation of Joseon. Dangun hence moved to Zhang Dangyong. Later, he returned in hiding to Asado and became a mountain god. He had lived 1,908 years. Tang, Tang Dynasty. This is that dynasty we all know. Pei Gu Zhen, Pei Gu. Pei Ju was a loyal retainer of Sui Dynasty. Chan, Biography. In the biography for Pei Ju of Tang Dynasty, Thursday said, Korea, Pon, Origin, Kojuku, Goju. Korea was originally from Goju, Ju, Zhou Dynasty, Yi, with this land. Invested Jizi and called Joseon. Han, Han Dynasty. Pun, to divide. They divided it. Qi, to set. Gun, commandery. They set up three commanderies and called Hyundu, Nangnang, and Tebang. Actually, it's pronounced like Nangnang. In the biography per page of Tang Dynasty, Thursday said, Goria was originally from Gojuk. The Zhou Dynasty invested Jizi with the land of Joseon. The Han Dynasty divided and ruled them as three commanderies, Hyundo, Nagrang, and Debang. Tongzhen, Tongdian, Yok, also, Tong, the same, Cha, this, Sir, story. Tongdian also has the same story. Well, today's reading is completed. We've come a long way, and now you understand the full story about old Joseon. You can download PDF text below. Thanks for watching, and if you have any question, please leave a comment.